All right, sir, time to get your racing gloves on. We have an entire episode that puts the word dangerous into the phrase dangerous driving. Like what? We have a story all about the dangers of driving while talking on your cell phone. There's a myth that there is no improvement in safety talking hands-free versus holding on to your phone, that they both distract you just as much and I think we should test that. Adam's gonna run this test twice. First, with the phone held in his hand, and then secondly, hands-free. Then I'm also gonna run the test twice, but I'm gonna do it in the inverse order. Hello. Hello, Adam. I've got my questions ready for you, and we're good to go. Three, two, one, here we go. Okay, so if you could compete with the Olympics, what event would you wanna be in? Um, if I could compete in the Olympics, I would, uh, hold on a second. There we go. Hold on, sorry. Um, I think I would do the luge because it requires, I think, the least amount of, uh, physical, uh, acuity. Adams flunked with flying colors. Jamie, I'm done. That was awful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna suck, I can tell you already. What was the question again? Why would you like to fly? Uh, well, because... That would, uh, it would save a lot of gasoline, actually. And, uh, you know, I could, uh, oh, look at that. I bumped over a whole bunch of things. <laughs> Jamie scores the worst result of the day, a disappointing 66. That was awesome. What do we get? Beautiful, near identical scores for each of the two techniques. Jamie and I have realized we need much more controlled, scientific, and realistic conditions, which is why we've come here to enlist the help of the experts at the Stanford University Automotive Innovation Facility. This is their state-of-the-art driving simulator. It is awesome. From the front seat of this car, you are completely immersed in a world controlled and designed by a computer. He's doing like 95, interesting. We'll see how he likes this. The 30 volunteer drivers will be judged on whether they pay attention to the GPS instructions. At the next intersection, turn left. And whether or not they crash. How much dirt is... Oh. We just ran down a cyclist. This test is over. When the next four volunteers also crash and burn... Ah! It's ah. looking good for the myth. Stop the car and... Please, license and registration, ma'am. <laughs> I suck at this. The guys have all the data they could hope for. Uh, I got to call you back. Yes, we have results. We tested 30 drivers out in Stanford, 15 hands full, 15 hands free. Here is the result. Uh, hands full, one passed, five failed by driving the wrong way, nine failed by crashing. Hands free, one passed, six failed by getting lost, and eight failed by crashing. What's that mean statistically? Statistically, it means no difference. Well, there you have it. Don't use your cell phone while you're driving. Yeah, yeah I'm done. Okay, so uh, where do you want to meet for lunch? Absolutely.